Brock and I are working on something special for you at the temple. Yeah? Hello everyone, my name is Ray. Today we're going to play some more God of War. It's part number 44. Thank you for joining me for today's episode. Last time we went and did a little bit of exploration. By a little bit of exploration, I mean we did a whole lot of exploration. And we got some stuff figured out. I think we're ready to go into the next area now. If not, I guess, oh well. But uh, we need to talk to the World Serpent and see what's up with the World Serpent. So, yeah, where you at? Go! How's everybody doing, by the way? Kratos here looking bald and beautiful because bald is beautiful. Go in the door, bro. Let's go! Why is Odin so desperate to find a way into Jotunheim anyway? He's convinced the giants hold the key to changing his fate when Ragnarok comes. Oh. They are the Aesir's oldest enemies, after all. And it's their army that's supposed to do him in in the end. But more than that, he covets their gifts of prophecy. He wants to know what they know and see what they see. So much suffering could have been avoided if his insatiable curiosity was not so much stronger than his wisdom. What do you mean? Ah, remind me to tell you why they call him the Lord of the Hanged. So that's really freaking stupid. Odin's interest in Jotunheim. He fears the giants at Ragnarok. He wants their prophecies of the future. Giants are the best of prophecy? Ask Mimir later why they call Odin Lord of the Hang. It's so freaking dumb. Because he's talking about prophecies and fates and all this other crap. Odin, not Mimir. Um, the idea of a prophecy and the idea of fate is that it cannot be changed. So he's using prophecies and fate to try and change his fate. That doesn't make any damn sense. And Ragnarok is something that's been preordained, so it shouldn't matter if, again, if he believes in any of that, it shouldn't matter what he tries to do. He's still gonna... Uh, and there's some pretty tough bastards to be going after um, Odin and actually winning. Hey guys, question for you. Anyone know where we can find Mimir's other eye? Oh. <laughs> that's... <laughs> I'm sorry. As a matter of fact, Odin asked me to... He wanted me to build a... He showed it to me, you see, and I... The coin? Sorry, will you excuse me? Fool? Well, that was useless. You know, it was about that same time that Odin came around looking for me to build a statue with some sort of hidden compartment. Now, that not being a weapon and the Aesir being a bunch of box-speckled cockers, I too saw fit to decline. But I know we got it built just the same. What was the statue? It's that one of Thor out there flashing his sack to the lake. The statue that the serpent ate. Sorry about that. Feeling much better. How are we supposed to look inside the snake? Inside? <laughs> We'd better go see what the world serpent has to say about that. <sighs> and yeah, I know we've already done that before, well, lies, but I don't know what lies ahead. But now would be a good time to make sure your gear is ready for the worst. Once more to the horn. Yeah, so I went and did that. I went and got the best gear that I am able to get. Actually, you know what? I don't know if I can upgrade any of it or not. I don't think so. But um, we may as well check. We're right here. My brother and me got a new project. Now that we're on speaking terms. Oh. What do you want? With the whetstone and hammer you've retrieved for us, Brock and I can construct the Devegrathiker, Dwarven Armor of Legend. We just need three more mythical ingredients before we set to hammer. Which are? Dunno. Armor's pure legend. And the details is fuzzier than a wolver's butthole. Do you expect us to find parts from a legend? Oh, Motsognir the Dwarf King found two of them. Everyone knows that. But when he went looking for the third, poof, he vanished. Maybe he'll find some clues at his stronghold in Konun's guard. And looky here. A Conan scarred entry stone. It's got your name on it. How fucking strange. <laughs> Alright, wait a minute. 
Lots of strongholds northwest of here, behind the Svartalfheim realm tower. Large stone structure, creepy atmosphere. You'll know it when you see it. So am I supposed to... Wait... Man... So can this the Holder brothers back in action again. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Never think I'd see such a day we was back to building as a duo. Yeah. But it feels right. Especially for this. Since I used to building on my own all these years, almost forgot how dang useful an extra pair of hands is. I forgot how much easier it is to smelt scap slag with someone else gauging the temperature. I'm about to say, you guys done with that? Because I, I want to hear everything you have to say. But I guess we're doing this first. I don't care. If this shit is actually going to be good, then that's where I'm going. This is what I'm going to do. I'm not trying to go into this area ill-prepared and get waxed by everything. So why do they call Odin the Lord of the Hay? That refers to a modest example of Odin's thirst for knowledge. The time he spent nine days a dead man. Aye. Hung himself by the neck from Yggdrasil's branches, put his spear through his own side, and bled down into the Well of Destiny. He roamed the realms of the dead and plundered the world tree of its secrets, until I think quite rightly it got fed up with him and sent him back to the land of the living. Did I not mention he was barking mad? How the heck does that work? Odin spent nine days dead hanging from Yggdrasil, the world tree, for the wisdom of life and death and destiny. He goes really far to get what he wants. I mean, hey, what the hell ever? I still don't know why they let me take my weapons out in there. Like, that makes me think I'll be able to fight somebody there eventually. Um, alright. Map. Hello? Uh, no. How the hell? Yeah. Man, I need to stop doing that. Um, so I'm sitting here, right? Seriously, isn't there a way for me to track that? There literally there there has to be, dude. Square doesn't work. X doesn't work. Nope. Alright, well. Whatever. How do I fudging... Well, this is south. This isn't the direction I want to go. It was north. Maybe we can go this way. I don't know. This might be just a complete waste of time, in which case I'm a massive idiot. It's all well and good. We know this. Last time I came here, it was kind of like a dead end, I think, so I'm not exactly sure what I expect to find here. But I can at least try and make this work, right? No? Can't go that way? Yeah, like, how the hell do I... Oh, shit. What the hell? What? Why, uh, why? Oh, it's dead. Is it? Wake your ass up. Oh, he's dead. Oh, there's a world serpent asleep. Huh. Let's go. Am I just wasting my time? I'm probably going in the wrong freaking direction. There sure is a lot to see here. Yeah, there sure is. There sure is, Atreus. We having a good... What the hell is that? Is that the thing that What's-His-Face is riding on? Um, Balder? I think so. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? See, like, this path here is... I have to go... You know what, man? Where's the, where's the damn? There's the world serpent. 
I'm sure this is like I don't even know how to get up there, bro. To that realm tear. There's a realm tear over there, and I have no idea how I'm supposed to get to it, or about this gate, or anything else. I I feel like I'm just wasting a lot of time here, and that's kind of starting to irritate me because I I don't like to waste time. What is this? Can I do something with this? Get some some free stuff. It is what it is, man. I um. I wanted to go and go into another area, maybe get that dwarven stuff. I'll do it later. Seriously, I'm not going to spend this episode not making any progress at all. That's going to suck. It's going to get on my nerves. And what's worse is going to get on my nerves. Let's go back to the... I ran right past it. Let's go back to the Mystic Gateway. Man, I could legit just start this episode right here. I've accomplished nothing for 12 minutes. I haven't fought anyone. I ain't seen anybody. I don't know. Maybe what's his face will give me some, uh, give me some more insight about Odin, his motives. Here's something I can't figure out. See, look, Odin I can do all this. Ride. But the serpent's already been there and seen it. So hasn't he already failed? Beats a tricky thing, lad. And Odin's just arrogant enough to think he can get the best of it. Fate is another lie told by the gods. Nothing is written that cannot be unwritten. On that, brother, you and the old father may just agree. Even if he can't prevent Ragnarok, he still hopes to learn enough details to influence the outcome. Remind me later to tell you about the wolves. I mean, all right. You could just... Odin thinks he can beat fate and change Ragnarok, even though the serpent's already been through it. Father doesn't think much of fate either. Another lie told by the gods. So they have that in common. I think you could just tell us now, dude. You're right here, but I mean, I know what Trace is going to ask. Oh, it's raining. That's fantastic. So yeah, I got to stop doing that. I keep looking at my uh, my shadow out of the corner of my eye. I see it moving. I'm like, oh my god, what is that? It's a spider. I don't lock spiders. Let's just go to the horn and get this over with. I don't care what's coming. I can overcome it. That's all well and good. I'm sure I'll be running into like high class, all kinds of shit. Trace, to me, my boy. Seriously, get over here. What is the problem? I d this game is really finicky with some of its items. That actually kind of <laughs> really <laughs> be something else, my man. Is a big boy. Why does he look so upset? How can he hear him? This is that you lost to us. He thinks it might still be in his stomach. Um, and he's open to letting you go into his mouth to look inside. Ew. All right. Really? By the by, he's not wild about it either. <laughs> what the hell? About to do, man. Letting the serpent swallow us? You do not have to come. Well, I'm not gonna miss this. You do not have to come. Where is he gonna go, Pops? Pop a dot. I need to go the other way. Come, Atreus. Let's do this. We're gonna go inside the serpent's. Gigantic freaking maw. Good lord, man. Oh! You sure oh. this is a good idea? Oh, shut up. No. It's a little late to be worried about it now, dude. Us, I've been to many strange places, but this will be a new one. <laughs> yeah. I've never been in the giant's belly either. How about you, father? 
Never one that was not trying to eat me. You really should expect that sort of response at this point. Man, you know his breath is kicking. How is this actually a level, by the way? I bet you this is like an actual place. Do it. Well, I can see exactly Jack and Squat in that order. Yeah. Belly of the beast. Uh oh. I used to dream about getting eaten. Dreams are nothing. I'm not afraid. It just reminded me of a way I used to feel when I was a child. Let's find that statue. So, if he poops me out, I want y'all to know I'm done with this game. If I actually have to watch them get pooped out, huh? Smells not as bad as I thought it'd be. Bit like heather ale fermenting. Rather pleasant, actually. You're so weird. Yeah, legit. That makes no sense, bro. The water kind of burns in here. That is water, isn't it? Hi. Why is it? It's lit up. What say? It's probably stomach acid. Are there actually going to be enemies in this daggone thing? There, the hammer. Oh, wait. This is where we're supposed to go? Alright. I legit just... Wait a minute. What hammer? Yo, I know this guy is big, but come on. I'm like, glad Brock I... and Sinji were able to work out the difference. Now they are twice as irritating. Ah, oh, I think it's nice to see them trust each other again. Yeah, come on, Pops. Don't be so cold-blooded. I think that's a song. I don't know. Well, I know it's a song, but I don't know who sings it. Hopefully not me. Doc, where? Over here? This is where I was going, but you said it a little early. I wasn't sure if we could... How in the heck... Yeah, yeah, hmm. I mean, it's a little late to be questioning the. Oh, it's a little late to be questioning the logic of this game. But I have. Over where? Does he feel this? Don't kill me. Uh. Come on. Oh, I get you. Oh, come the heck on, bro. Is this part of him? Is this part of him, or is this is this part of this this poor creature? Like legit, man. I know he's big. I I know he's forget big. Something? I ain't forget nothing. Like, I I know he's big, but still, this has gotta suck for him. Lemire, any idea where Odin hid your eye? No, it's not like I can still see through it. Probably like up Thor's butt. 
and I don't say that as a joke, I say that because I can't think of any other reason why Sindri would have thrown up at the thought of where it was in a statue. Sindri's got a queasy stomach, but come on, bro. He's got plants growing in his gut, man. Like, legit, what? Oh, God. I don't even want to. Like, I would usually test that to see what's up, but no. Yep, that's an eye. Maybe you should stick that in my head for safekeeping. Gently now, gently. Thank you, brother. You don't miss depth until it's gone. Well, okay, wait a wait a freaking minute, man. Homeboy made it sound like. He made it sound like this was going to be a tough thing to do. We literally just basically walked up in here. Le legit, we just... What is this? Hyper activation chance to grant a blessing of runic on any successful prayer. And we legit just walked up in this trick. Took it and left. Something has to be... Something has to happen on the way out, man. Like, I, I honestly didn't expect anything to be here. Um, in his gut. Considering it's in his gut. But still, this just... And what the hell did we need that... Well, I wouldn't say I'm feeling whole again. But it's a right improvement. The Bifrost is intact. It'll serve. Then we have all we need. Finally, we're going to Yudna. There's no stopping us now. Yeah, well, Bloody, something's gonna happen. Have you ever heard the term tempting fate? Fate is another lie told, told by, by the gods. gods. Yes, of course. You really are your father's son, you know. Like, it's all good. I don't remember what we needed his eye for. I really don't, because he already had one. I, I don't remember. Oh God, what's going on? Yeah. Well, that was mildly terrifying. Maybe our presence is upsetting Jormungandr's belly. No, something is wrong. Baldur's attacking him, maybe? What's happening to him? Nothing good. Glad that's over. Is he getting hit? What is that? We must hurry. Couldn't agree more, brother. Is it like a dragon or something? Out there? I know Baldur is tough, but I can't see Baldur doing that on his own. I really just can't. The board shifting! I'm gonna... I like how the compass is still moving. Gotta know what direction we're facing. Oh, freaking K, dog. Oh, hell to the top. You ain't survived that, Kratos. I know you tough, boy. No, what's happening to him? Not my big buddy. Boy. Boy. I'm good. I'm getting kind of used to this. What, what happened, happened to him? Something we did? No. Something else. A dead giant. Why would the serpent leave us here? Look! Is that Freya? Or Balder? Oh, it's Freya. Freya. What the hell? We can still trust her. Right? Until we know for certain. Keep her distance. The world serpent. What's happened here? We hoped you would know. You are far from home. 
I'm looking for my son. The two of you. You helped me see things more clearly. You do not know where he is then? No. But the woods and fields speak his name. I know he walks here in Midgard. When did you see him last? Long ago. What did you, you do? Before you were even born. Why are you standing so far from me? What's wrong? Something's happened. There! Dude! I had a feeling hurting the big snake would bring the two of you. How did you do that on your own, dude? Do you have any idea? Any idea at all? What you have cost me. What did we do? We just beat you up, yeah, but... My boy. Mother. What are you referring to when you I'm ask scared. if we know what we cost you? Don't run away. Oh, I'm not going anywhere, Mother. I know that you're still angry. I know that... How you feel hasn't changed, but I, I want you to... How, how I feel? How I feel? <laughs> I've spent the last 100 years dreaming of this moment. I've rehearsed everything I ever wanted to say to you, every word, to make you understand exactly what you stole from me. But now, I realize I don't need you to understand anything. I don't need you at all. No, back off, Kratos. This has nothing to do. In this path you walk, vengeance. You will find no peace. I know. You. I'll deal with you later. Family first. <clears throat> really? This again? Oh, so I could actually end this here? <laughs> I think I'm going to do that. It, it was a safe spot. I'm probably going to get my butt whipped relentlessly. I like how he's just like, really? We're going to do this again? It's about 30 minutes of recording time. I guarantee when I beat this fool, I'm going to have cutscenes and all manner of crap. So no, uh, this is where we're going to end this episode for now. Thank you for watching as always. My name is Ray. It's a good little cliffhanger. I appreciate that. We didn't really do much, all things considered. We went into the World Serpent, got an eye, and left. That's pretty much a summary of the video. Um... But still, like I said, next episode we fight Balder. Hopefully we beat him, and then we move on. But until next time, when we actually get this taken care of, and it, it feels like we're actually getting really close to the end of the game. But until next time, goodbye, everybody.